All right, for today's build, we've got Solar Titan, Middle Tree. You're going to be running Fusion Grenades. You can run Towering or Rally, doesn't matter. Um, and then I always say run Strafe Lift. You can run whatever you want. Strafe Lift is obviously the best, though. Anyways, jumping into mods. We're going to start with your helmet. You're going to want it to be a Solar Affinity with Bountiful Wells so that whenever you use elemental ordnance, which is going to be the main way of generating orbs, or I mean uh, wells, you're going to get two wells instead of one. So it just gives you extra grenade energy so that you get your grenade back faster, so you can keep making more wells, keep throwing out grenades, keep roaring flames going, and just destroy everything. You're going to run double ashes to assets, uh, because again, you're going to be throwing out a ton of grenades, get extra super energy just a great little addition uh your general can be whatever need you need to like balance out your build but the main thing that you're going to want is just as high as you can get discipline 90 is i'd say probably the lowest you'd want to go if not to tier one or uh, tier 10 but going into the exotic you're going to be running for this build ashen wake with uh Solar Elemental Affinity, Elemental Ordnance, so when you defeat a combatant, as I said, with your grenade, it'll spawn in a Elemental Well that matches your subclass type. Of course, it's going to be Solar, so Impact Induction, uh, causing damage with a melee attack, reduces your grenade cooldown, and since you're going to be using the Throwing Hammer, you can hit somebody with the Bonk, go pick it up, and keep doing that. If for some reason you just don't have your grenade, you can do that in a loop to get your grenade back fast. The uh, champion mod, I would recommend running overload rounds because you're going to want to run uh, the summoner, as I'll show you in a second here. On the chess piece, you're going to run, doesn't matter what the elemental affinity is, but you're going to want to run elemental charge, so whenever you pick up one of those wells, from your grenade kill, you're going to become charged with light, which will feed into a mod I'll get to in just a second here. Uh, concussive dampener reduces AoE damage. Uh, I'm not entirely sure if this counts for potential AoE you might hit yourself with if you throw the grenade too close to yourself, but I believe it does, so that's why I like to run it. Uh, Thermoshock plating is just a really great mod to have this season, and again, just trying to get that discipline up. Now, the reason why you want Charge with Light is because of this mod right here. Heal thyself while you are Charged with Light. Grenade Final Blows heal you and consume one stack of Charged with Light. So since you can be throwing out a ton of grenades, this is also a good way to get health back by doing so. And then Innervation, so that whenever you pick up any Orb of Power, you're going to get reduced uh, grenade cooldown time and recuperation, so whenever you pick up an Orb of Power, you're going to get health back as well as the grenade energy. And finally, for mods, you're going to run a Solar Affinity uh, Titan Mark with Well of Ordnance. So whenever you pick up those Solar Elemental Wells, it'll grant you additional gra grenade energy just feeding into you always having a grenade, just throw a fireball. So, you can either run double bombers, or if you also want a bit more uh, utility with this build, run Inferno Whip so that your solar melee, your, your throwing bonk, will also stun unstoppable champions. <clears throat> as far as the uh, weapons go, I do not currently have what I'd like to have for the uh, first slot, which would be probably a sniper with Adrenaline Junkie. Um, but right now I'm just running Demolitionist, so again, keep my grenade cooldown like, to zero, basically. And then Summoner, uh, I like to run this specific role. I find it really nice to have Overflow with Golden Tricorn, so you're just constantly shooting. Golden Tricorn's basically always going to be up because you're going to be throwing out so many grenades, so you're going to get that nice damage buff. Um, 
But again, if you don't want to play Trials or something, just a good solid like Demolitionist and uh, Adrenaline Junkie would be a really solid weapon for you to have. And then finally, I like to throw in Galahorn because it just ridiculous damage helps the build in case something your fireball can't kill, aka your grenade. Um, then Galahorn can clean up the extra damage that you might need. And then the last part of this build is my Drestiny. I always like to come up with a look. And I used Horizon Blush for the shader. Uh, I felt it looked really nice with this armor. The Sunbreak Helm chest piece and boots. And then Radagast's Iron Sash for the mark. And that is the look I really liked for this build. So that's what I went with. So that is your Ashen Wake Fireball Solar Titan build. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe and comment if you have any questions or uh, exotic weapon and armor combo piece that you'd like me to come up with a build for. Thanks for watching.